Welcome to Awesome Kid. Please subscribe to my channel and like my video. In this video, we are going to add an index page to our web application. In our other video, we added the view to our existing controller. So if we go to our URL on localhost 8080, we do welcome. And I need to start my application first. And now the application is started, we can go to our URL and just hit enter. And this way we get the default value. And if we pass the query string with the name and its value, then we get that welcome and the name that we enter over here are passed to our controller. But if we remove this whole after this a power flash and hit enter, we get this error page. So we are going to add our index.html file, which will be use our home page for our web application and when we use this URL, it will show the index.html. We can re remove the index.html and just use the address up to here. It will pull up a index.html file for us. Let's go to our Eclipse and under the source main resources, there is a static folder. This folder is for static files. I'm just going to right click on it and do the other and we can select the html just type in html file and we'll click next here i'm going to name it index.html and just click on finish i will change the title first to home page and now I'm going to add some adding tag I will stop the application now I'm going to say over here please enter your name then I'm going to add a form and the action of this form will take us to our controller. And the method for our request type will be of get. I'm going to add a table with a table row and we are going to have some table data and in this table data I'm going to get the input from the user we are going to ask for the input name from a user so this input type will be text input type text and then name set to name And now I'm going to have another table data. In this table data, I'm going to add input type submit. And the value which will be shown 
on our uh, button will be submit to now we can start our application run as java application our application is started we can go back to url we don't need to type in index.html we can just hit enter and it will pull up that index.html page for us and we get this simple form here we can type some name such as mike and hit enter and we get welcome mike Keep on learning. Please subscribe to my channel, Asinco. Like my video, keep supporting me, and thank you for watching.